Gishu Cuisine, Wikipedia Audio Gishu Cuisine, or Chien Cuisine, consists of cooking traditions and dishes from Gishu Province in southwestern China. Gishu Cuisine shares many features with Sichuan Cuisine and Hunan Cuisine, especially in bringing the sensation of spiciness and pungency. What makes Gishu cuisine unique is the emphasis of a mixed sour and spicy taste, as compared to the numbing and hot sensation featured in Sichuan cuisine and the dry hot taste featured in Hunan cuisine. There is an ancient local saying, without eating a sour dish for three days, people will stagger with weak legs. The saying reflects how Gishu people love local dishes with a sour taste. The combination of sour and spicy flavors is also found in Shaanxi cuisine. Gishu cuisine differs from Shaanxi cuisine in that it lacks the emphasis on the salty taste, which is a common trait found in most northern Chinese cuisines. In addition, the unique sourness featured in Gishu cuisine comes from the local tradition of fermenting vegetables or grains, and not from using vinegar products. Gishu cuisine comprises many local varieties and dishes from ethnic minorities, such as the Miao people. Some famous local cuisines are represented by large cities like Giyang, Junyi, and Liupanshui. Gishu cuisine has matured since the beginning of the Ming dynasty. Features Gishu is famous for producing high quality Chinese liquor, Beiju. One of the most famous and expensive beiju in China, Mao Tai is from Gishu. Gishu cuisine also features dishes specially cooked to match the flavor of locally produced liquor, such as preserved vegetables and steamed cured meat. Gishu cuisine features various pickled vegetable, or yan ke. The pickled vegetables are refreshing and healthy, and more importantly, bring the sour sensation. Fresh vegetables are dried without exposure to sunlight after being cleaned. Afterwards, they are salted and sealed in containers for four or five days to allow proper fermentation. Pickled cabbage and radish are served as side dishes, and popular to be consumed with noodles and rice noodles. The Sour Soup Broth representative of Gishu cuisine with unique sourness, is a cooking heritage from the Miao people. It is the secret to create the famous Gishu dish fish in sour soup. The broth is normally made from the fermentation of rice, rice wine, wild tomatoes, red pepper, garlic, and ginger. Spicy dipping sauce is crucial in daily dinning of Gishu people. It is made by mixing chili pepper, garlic, ginger, green scallion, sesame oil, or soy sauce, according to personal preference. One unique ingredient used in Gishu dipping sauce is houtunia, which is loved by local people but not commonly accepted by other Chinese with its distinct taste. Various types of spiciness in Gishu cuisine come from the art of using chili peppers in different ways by locals. Hula is created by heat drying crushed chili pepper. Sibila refers to both the uncooked mashed chili pepper paste and the chili sauce by simmering the paste in oil. Zhao La is made by preserving minced chili pepper with ginger and garlic. Lokua La is spice flavored chili flakes. The renowned chili sauce brand, Lao Gan Ma, is originated from Gishu. There are two fried rice dishes originated from Gishu and popular on the dining tables of locals, fried rice with egg and zhao la, and guayal yu fried rice. Notable dishes in Gishu cuisine, fish in sour soup, stir-fried chicken with sibala, stir-fried hao tunia with Chinese bacon, Crispy whole fish with zhao la, braised trotter in brown sauce, stir fried kinji and tofu, etc. Notable appetizers and street food in Gishu cuisine 
siwa, love tofu, and chong wang noodles. Notable dishes.